I know, it's so pretty out here. I know, that's, I was going to say, it sounds like it's all right with you. And I was just like, man, I'm going to have a great day when I came in this morning. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, that's okay. It happens. Better luck next time. Yeah, definitely. Still better than being at work. Oh, yeah, anything. <laughs> <laughs> it definitely beats it. Nice. Y'all yeah, have a good one. You too, man. All right, so we are here at spot number two in West Bay. Um, you know, Lewis was just begging me yesterday to try to hit the surf with him. <laughs> so against my own free will, he held me hostage and made me go. Well, you saw how that turned out. So Lewis likes to waste my Saturdays. No problem, Lewis. <laughs> All right, so we're over here, West Bay. We're gonna try to give the old college try out here. I'm gonna toss some more chicken boys. Had some luck on them last time. I'm gonna ride the train to the wheels fall off with these chicken boys. Um, I've never, well, I've never launched from this spot, but um, I have fished some of the area. So hopefully we'll be able to pick up where I left off last time. Kind of pretty good out here, so we'll see. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Let's hopefully you catch us hooking up. All right, so we have right here, we got a reef. So I don't want to get too close to it. I want to get the bait a little close to it. Does any of you have like oyster reefs or any kind of depth change? A lot of times the fish will hug along the side of it and use that kind of like a, a highway, if you will, <laughs> where they will come in and out and chase bait. So anytime you have any kind of depth change, it's always a good spot, you know, or any kind of structure is always good good time to try to fish around any of those things. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water and a croaker. Yeah. Let's hit the water. He smashed it. It's on the croaker. Oh no. This is a good one right here. This is a good one. Come on, buddy. Come on. Don't get all tangled up. Man. Ah, this guy just salvaged the day. You just saved the day. Got him on that coastal corks. You know, just that rattle. That is. Some sexy rattle right there. Man, he just he just demolished that croaker. You know, I don't use croaker very often. This morning. It's only live that they had, so I only used it today by default, but I've been wanting to pick some up and try some again. <sighs> but um, you know, this guy crushed it. And um he's strong. He could feel this. He hit it like a bull and just charge right with it. He's gonna come in at 20 and a quarter inch. 20 inch speckle trout. This beautiful fish is going to live to swim another day. I'm not harvesting any fish today, and like most time I do not. Lewis doesn't want any, so we're gonna. Take one more look at this guy. Beautiful fish. Look at that nice big yellow mouth. Nice girthy guy. I'm gonna let you go and let you swim off. Oh yeah, tons of fight left in him. He just, like I said, he hit it. Hit it so hard. It's like a bull, so. Awesome, awesome. Great catch. That made the day for me. And let's see if we can do it again. You know, we have a handful of croakers left from this morning from fishing the surf so hopefully we'll uh, be able to hook up again skip yeah skip jack trout 
He came out of the water. I thought he was a skipjack. Another big one. Let's see if I can get another crank on this guy. Ugh. Croaker, coastal cork. Just freaking. He just hammered it again. Let's see. Beautiful, beautiful guy. Or girl, whatever you are. Almost identical, just barely missing 20 inches. There she is. A little bit of mark on the bottom. Probably from feeding on those oysters. Probably misjudged the wave, huh? Alright, we're gonna see you later, girl. There. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful fish. Three! Three for three! This one feels a lot better. Yep, this one feels a lot better. Swimming at me. Yep. Nope. That's why I felt better, because it's a red. Looks like it's going to be an undersized red. But man, he is strong. Strong little guy. Where are you at? Where you at, buddy? Come on. A few spots there. Nice little guy. Nice color. I like that nice copper color. Look at his fins. Right here. His fins. Half white. Half copper. That's pretty cool. Alright, guy. Freaking weekend warrior. Then they gotta deal with this. See? Don't be that guy. Do not be that guy. Hey everybody, so that's gonna do it for us today. Uh, myself and Lewis hit a couple different spots up. Uh, you know, the surf looked just amazing today, but unfortunately there was nothing out there. Um, oh, oh. <laughs> hit a couple holes. Anyway, um, so yeah, so thanks, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification button. Let you know next time we upload a video. Um, did salvage the day. Got a couple specs on. But other than that, you know, it was a slow day. But, um... You know, some intel from him. Some of the guys were killing it a little further down where we were going to originally go. We ended up going to the surf because it looked so amazing. But thanks, thanks again. Like, subscribe, as always. Hopefully next time you'll catch me. Hopefully next time you catch me. Hook it up. Thanks.